guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a giant TJ Maxx haul to share with you. Literally, it's been piling up so much that I just really need to get this film so that I can unbag all this stuff. Like literally, I need to take tags off of stuff and start using it. Some of which is like kind of like necessity stuff. I bought a lot of cute stuff, a lot of makeup, probably a lot of stuff that I don't even remember. And I think this has been piling up since my birthday, which was December the 16th. So yeah, it's been too long. Also, I'm loving my makeup today. I use the ColourPop Lilac You A Lot palette. So if you're curious what I'm wearing, that is it. But I think it's so, so pretty. And let's get right into it because this is going to take too long. So first thing, we actually use this. This is by the Skinny Syrups, Jordan Skinny Syrups brand. And this is like a set of all these different flavors that we got. The only thing about this is it seems like these were kind of like watered down. This set was $9.99 for eight flavors and which in theory would be really great to try out. But I can promise you that just something about these, they weren't as good as the regular bottles. Like you had to use the whole thing in a cup just to feel like you had any flavor. So yeah, kind of a sucky purchase there, but oh well. Next, I got this bag and I literally bought this as like my birthday present to myself and I still haven't used it. Pathetic. But this is a really pretty like it almost has like a hint of rose but mostly like a nude colored faux leather of course this is from the brand mystique I'm sure it's nothing that special but I really like the design of it I like the braided little handles it's very sleek I just wanted this honestly it's just so pretty and sleek it's girly but not overly so and I feel like it's really a chic style as well this was only $34.99 so not too bad for a really nice bag I think it's gonna hold up well it wouldn't be a TJ Maxx haul without a blanket and this one is so adorable it's by Berkshire Loft this is a full queen size and it has little otters on it. This one was $20 because it's a little bit bigger and this one is a 90 by 90 so it's a pretty darn big blanket hence the price but it's just one of those like really soft cuddly blankets and I love it. Otters are so adorable. All right I thought this was really pretty. This is a jar. Ah! All right I thought this was really pretty just for the jar. It was only $5.99 and it's like this faux marble. And it's a pretty sturdy like material. I'm guessing it's ceramic, but it actually has like makeup sponges in it. I don't really intend on using these, but maybe I can find, I don't know, some kind of purpose. Maybe I can donate them with some makeup. Only $5.99 for that. I felt like it was a really decent size for the price. I feel like I might have shown this in a haul or in a vlog. If I've already hauled this, I'm so sorry. But this is the Mighty Hot Sauce Challenge. It's got five flavors in it and it was $7.99. I bought this for my beautiful friend to come over and film a video, but she's a little bit nervous about starting to film videos. I think she'd be really good at it though. So I was like, you should definitely come over and she's Hispanic, so she knows about all the good Hispanic food. And I'm like, we should totally do this and we can test out like my my hot tolerance with your hot tolerance and see but yeah i think it would be really fun to do that so thumbs up if you want to see a hot sauce challenge and leave it in the comments below as well you're probably going to see several of these these are the shiseido cottons they are 7.99 at tj maxx and of course it's a lovely skincare item to get because it's not going to go bad they're usually i think 12 or 13 dollars at sephora so it's a pretty good savings off of that those are just staple items for me so i just when i see them i pick them up ah this toothpaste we actually went through the entire tube is the Tom's Luminous White Natural with Fluoride. I actually really really love this toothpaste and this was $3.99 at TJ Maxx so not bad. I will definitely pick more of this up. I like this one a lot. Yeah I'm finding stuff that I've forgotten about. So this is a little bodysuit I thought would be so cute just for like filming or to wear with jeans and a jacket. It's a little bit more on the slinky side. It's leopard print and it's a really nice soft material that's got some stretch to it. I think this would be just a really chic thing to pair with a otherwise neutral outfit and it was only $9.99. I feel like that's gonna be absolutely adorable. I may have to wear this in my next video. And then I got this t-shirt. This was a Disney collection, only $7.99. This is really cute. It says me after canceling my plans. This is definitely me. I love the idea of having plans and like going out and having a life and it's just like the couch is comfortable. There's coffee. I don't know. I literally act like an old person. So I also got this. This is a NYX brush. Um, this is the Paradise Fluff. I actually bought three of these and this was one of the items in my last Vlogmas giveaway if you didn't notice. So $4.99 for that. I got one for myself and two for a giveaway. That one has passed but I do have a big one going on if you guys 
want to check it out, be sure to do that below. I think I'm going to end it around Valentine's Day. I also found this Sigma brush. It's a Extreme Structure Control F04. This was like a more dense, maybe like contour brush. I like a brush this size when I'm doing like my actual cheekbone contour and right up under the jaw, just a little bit more precision. This was $9.99 for a Sigma brush. I think that was pretty good. I got this for $8. This was on clearance. It's a little Calvin Klein like bralette. I don't really think you could call this a sports bra unless it was, it would be considered a low impact for sure. But I thought this was really cute with the green. I don't really have anything quite like this, especially that's like a mint. And I've been buying like Calvin Klein underwear from TJ Maxx that I've been liking a lot. So so, yeah, eight dollars for that guy. Oh, I got this too. I forgot. This is a Real Techniques face and body blender. This was only five ninety nine, and I just thought this would be interesting for like body shimmers or like a body bronzer. I don't know. I just thought it would be interesting to have, especially when we get into warmer weather. And I have some, you know, a little bit more slinky on, and I want to give a little glow. I thought that would be really fun to have. I also got these. These are from Nicole Miller. These star ones are really what caught my eye, but it is for hair clips. They started carrying a lot of cute. Ones. This set was $5.99, so you can definitely find some adorable, affordable ones. And if you go to your local TJ Maxx, check it out because mine had like an entire little section of just like hairpins and hair clips and things like that. I have super fine hair. If you guys don't know, like it is ridiculously fine. So that's as good as we're gonna get, but it's really cute. Oh, almost lost these little guys. So these were $12.99. They are Betsy Johnson. Oh, and I forgot these are so cute. Yes, I'm gonna have to wear these soon. So they are like little foxes with little crowns on. Look how cute. Oh, they're just adorable. I love like funky ears. Ooh. I love funky earrings and I feel like these would look really cute with my makeup right now too, but I'm going to have to wear these really soon. And I'm pretty sure I bought this one for Zach and this is a pumpkin scent. So that tells you I've had it since December at least, but this one smells a little bit more manly. It's smoky pumpkin. This one's $7.99. I seriously do this almost every time. I'm like, Ooh, smell it. But it's really cute. It's like a black matte packaging and it is a little bit more of a cologne scent. It's got a wood wick in it too. So it would kind of have that crackle. And I thought that he might like to take this and put it in his office because he does like, you know, some masculine scents. So I will pass that along to him. Probably was meant to be a Christmas gift. This also I've had too long because this is winter dream vanilla and it's a hand soap and lotion it's a little set the dish is really cute too it's like the ceramic and then the bottles have these bear on them it's so cute which I can definitely still use these. It's still winter. These aren't like super Christmassy, but I definitely intended to use these sooner. And this was only $6.99 for the soap, the lotion, and the dish. This was like such a crazy good deal. And yeah, I love this for like a guest bath or something. It's so cute. Let's see when this receipt was from. Oh my God, this was from December the 12th. Just one of the mini receipts that's probably floating around in here. But I got a couple of Laura Mercier lip pencils. I saw these and they were only $4.99. This is such a good deal. I got the shade Natural Lip and hazelnut tea. Both of these also come with a sharpener. I do feel like um, it's a little bit wasteful to like get every single one with a sharpener. I, I don't know. I guess maybe some people lose sharpeners or they keep, you know, sharpener in their purse for the lip liner. I don't know. It's a little bit wasteful, but it is nice if you don't already have one. So two, two little sharpeners there. And I know natural lips is a really popular one for a more natural contoured lip. All right, so Natural Lips is on the bottom. It's a little bit browner. And then Hazelnut Tea is on the top, which has just a little bit more of a pink, but both really good nudes. They're a little bit more of a firmer pencil too, which I like just to kind of make sure you don't bleed if you do put on something really creamy. I got the Eyelore Lux Opulent Lashes. They're mink effect, but they're not real mink. And I thought these were cute because they have a lot of like crossover in them. So I feel like it could be like really wispy looking. I don't know. I just think they're cute. I got this. This is a Korean brand. It is Me Factory and they're the Pig Collagen Pore Heating Blackhead Clear and Pore Tightening Little Mask. I thought this was so cute. This was only $3 and they're like little packs. So it's three step for the nose, I believe. Yeah, Piggy Nose Pore Pack. Hey! Get out. Mr. Minners just did like some sort of wrestling slam and like pushed Tina into the door. You little bastards! Sometimes I don't know what to do with these crazy cats. Just having to walk through all the like lights and stuff. I'm sorry, baby. Come get in your chair. There's so much mess in here that she's looking at me like, 
Can you pick some of this up? I also found this, which I was really excited about. For only $2.99, it's from CoverGirl, the Chocoholic Contour Palette. I thought about getting this a while back and I didn't. So when I saw it for three bucks, I was like, why not? This kind of smells like hot chocolate, like definitely chocolatey, but it's got like this rich kind of creamy scent to it as well. So those are the three shades, really pretty. Ah, I also got my Christmas cards at TJ Maxx, but I've already sent them out, obviously. This box of 16 was $5.99, and I feel like these are the cutest cards. It says, it's the moose wonderful time of the year, and it's got a moose on it. So I have a few left over, but they're so cute. This is like a surprise bag. I got some more Calvin Klein underwear. Totally forgot. So I got a, these are just like regular bikinis. I got a black and a gray pair. This was $9.99 for the two. So really good like staple undies. Oh, I forgot about this. I got the NARS Wanted to Cheek Palette. This was only 20 bucks. NARS can be pretty pricey and I, I looked this up and it was a fairly recent product. I always do that. So if you guys wonder like, when I'm shopping in there, what do I do? I always make sure like, how old is the product? Can I still find it for sale? That's always a good sign, obviously. And then if you can, you can check batch codes as well. So this is really pretty. Look at those colors. And then the front has got like this pixelated look of like a cheek. I think that's cheek, lip, nose, eye. Like it's a little face, but it's pixelated. I think that's really cool looking. I also picked up the Too Faced Pineapple Glow Moisturizing and Brightening Face Mask. This was a cool find. Again, always make sure that it's not been opened, it's not been touched. If I can, ch check a batch code. But this was like really, really clean around the edge. And you can tell if you lift this up, oh, it smells like pineapple. You'll be able to automatically see like if it's been opened. So that's what it looks like. I have a fun mask. I don't know if it's going to be that super effective but i definitely think it's cute and then i also got this because i had picked up the natural lust palette from too faced and this is the natural lust bronzer i had actually seen this and wanted it it's got a really beautiful packaging like a little bit more sophisticated than their normal stuff and the bronzer is huge and it's really pretty and glowy i feel like this one's going to be great in the summertime one of my recent finds was really cool because this set i think was originally I want to say maybe around 50 bucks, but it was on sale at Sephora for $28. I got it on clearance for $8. This is from Penrose. It has a shimmer mist that's like in a rollerball size, a little stone, all the samples of their scents, and then also this was just an intention card deck, which I was actually really curious to see what that would be like out of the box because obviously I haven't seen it. So here is the other little stuff in here. A little stone is cute. And this is a pretty decent size. It's in the shade Secret Genius, which is a nice scent from them. All right, let's see what this card deck looks like. Oh, these are cute. So it's the different scents and they all have a card. That's Merry Maker, Pillow Talk Poet, Wild Child, Tambourine Dreamer. These are so pretty. Secret Genius, that's a funky one. Kind of reminds me of the Mayned from True Blood. Anybody else? No. Oh, this is just a shade of Penrose. A little dipper. Sun Saint. This one's Gilded Fox. This one's really cool looking. I definitely think Pillow Talk Poet is my favorite because she's here with the little lion. Okay, so those are the cards. I got these little sports bras as well. They're from Danskin. I really just liked this like pink one, but it was a set of two for $9.99. They have little padding in them, which I'm going to take out. The black one feels super, super small. Like I don't feel like these two match. Maybe that's why they're a mess. Or maybe this was supposed to be $9.99 by itself and somebody just stuck something else on there. Oh God. Because this one's definitely a large and it's... Well, maybe they're the same size. I don't know. At any rate, this is what it looks like. I think it's really pretty. And I'm going to take the padding out. It's just going to be a nice little, like, lightweight little bralette sports bra thing. Oh, this I got recently, and I thought it was a good deal as well. This is an Under Armour little hoodie. This was only $19.99, originally $55. I love the color of this. And the neck is different, too. So it's like this light, light pink, which is soft with the Under Armour logo. But the neck is different. Like, it kind of comes up a little bit before your hood. So it kind of rises a little bit. Hey. And for $20 for Under Armour, not a bad deal. Also got two Dr. Jart masks. These are the Shake and Shot. So they were both $5.99. I think they're usually $12 or $13. So a pretty decent deal. I got the Rubber Hydro Mask and the Rubber Firming Mask. So they look like this. Zach thinks that they are super, super creepy. Another bag. 
let's see. Oh, this just has one thing in it. So this is a little camo print hoodie. I thought this was just like really cute. It was on clearance for $10 and it's pretty plain, but I love it. Like I feel like a cute little camo. I really like my camo shirt with New York on it. So I just thought this would be a nice little comfy piece in my wardrobe and 10 bucks. You can't beat it. What have we got here? Okay, so I got these napkins for some reason. These are her Harry Potter napkins and they have the Hogwarts seal on them. They were on clearance for 70 cent. So I guess I just figured, why not? And then I got this It Cosmetics brush. This was $14.99, but I feel like this brush is regularly like 58 or something crazy like that. But it's the Heavenly Skin Bye Bye Pores brush. It's the Heavenly Skin one. This one's really, really nice. I love It Cosmetics brushes, but they can be really, really pricey. So when I saw this one, I was like, oh, let me get it really quick. Finally, another product from Laura. It's the Effortless Nude Lip Collection. This went for $35. They had it for $9.99 at TJ Maxx. And I think it's just a line and a lip and I love the packaging it's so cute so it comes in almost like folds out like a little book this is really pretty so it is the shade rosewood this one's definitely a little pinker than the other two so that's rosewood right there and then this one's called beige and thyme which is a nice little pinky beige color cute the quality of these is really amazing so both of those were 9.99 i was like yes please let me get that i also bought this bath rug this one's a 20 by 32 it was 12.99 and i just really like this like i don't know if it's like slate kind of color like blue gray but it's really nice it's a memory foam one and the one i've had for the longest time was just looking really worse for wear and then i had toilet issues and it got really messy in the bathroom <laughs> so i was like yeah it's time to replace it so i got this rug oh my god i still have so much okay speed round this is the harry potter party set that i actually saw multiple times and i was like oh that's really cute i need that i don't know what i'm gonna use this for but they're so cute it's plates cups and napkins and this one says mischief managed it has the marauders map on the napkin and this was on clearance for eight dollars so it's got 20 plates 20 cups and 20 napkins I don't know what I'm gonna do with this but maybe just like watch Harry Potter and eat off of these I don't know this bag is a whole lot of goodies so I found some good skincare I got the lash food conditioning eye makeup remover this was only $3.99 and I don't I didn't have a lot of eye makeup removers like I still like need some so this is going to come in really handy and it's supposed to condition your lashes I got this Murad multivitamin infusion oil only $19.99 I can't remember the full price of this usually but it's much much more than that and I love the way that this oil feels and this one hasn't been out very long like I remember getting trained on this not that long ago so this was an amazing find I also got this. This is the Genius Sleeping Collagen from Algenist. This originally goes for, I think, $98. I found it for $39.99. This is also another product that has not been out very long at all. So I don't know, maybe they just made too much of it. But when I saw this, I literally was like, oh my God. Like I had been wanting to buy it, but I didn't want to spend that much on it. But this stuff is so, so luxurious. And for that price, like, I just could not beat it. So here I am with my sleeping collagen. Oh, I got two of those. So I got two of the Lash Food Eye Makeup Removers for $3.99. And then I got another one of the Glam Glow Instamud. This is the 60 Second Pore Refining Treatment. This was $21.99. I actually have one of these and I actually like it. It's one of those like bubbly masks and sometimes I feel like those don't do very much, but this one I feel like my skin is really clean and my pores are tight afterwards. Shiseido Cotton. Shiseido cotton, $7.99 each. I got this headband. It's a terry cloth headband with little ears on it. And this was only $3.99. I think it's gonna be so cute. I love cute things when I'm doing my skincare. It just makes it a little bit more fun. Also got these Holika Holika Acai Berry Pure Essence Mask Sheet. Now the essence sheets are the ones that I love the most and these just sounded absolutely divine. It is a box of 10. I always put some of these in my giveaways as well so you can look forward to that. But this box was $7.99. This is the best stuff. This is the This Works Deep Sleep Pillow Spray. I'm using this right now. And it's so funny because I bought one at Ulta because it was on sale like 30 or 40% off. Then I got one in a subscription box. And then I found this one for $12.99 and I was like, 
please give it to me. I think it's usually like 25, it's pretty expensive, but now I have backups and I love to spritz that on my pillow before I go to sleep. So this is what I've been putting in my coffee when I'm on keto. So we've got this Jordan Skinny Syrup and we got a few flavors. These were all $3.99. I got Butter Toffee, which looks like these. I got cinnamon vanilla, that sounds delicious. And then vanilla almond, I have not tried that one before. Apparently two more. This one is the chocolate caramel truffle, that sounds really good. And then this one is a different brand, but it's salted caramel. And this is the flavor I've been using most recently. It's really good. I've got one more little bundle and then I swear we're almost done. And in this I have a little bit of TJ Maxx and then I also got a few things at Ross to show you. So I got these at TJ Maxx. They're little Valentine card kits. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these and frankly, maybe this was a stupid purchase, but they were $6.99 each and they have cards and little pins in them. And I think they're so cute. They have little camping. This one's got like hedgehogs, bears, raccoon, fox. And this one's got dinosaurs on it. I just thought they were really cute. I think I'm actually gonna take those to work with me too for people and give like little Valentine notes. I think that would be cute. Oh my God, I got this notebook and it is amazing. It says Psychic Predictions. This was $4.99 and it's got cats on it. They're like little, what do you call it? They like read the crystal ball. You know what I'm talking about. I got some snacks that were like really low carb. I got dry roasted edamame with sea salt. And this only has nine carbs per serving, but six of those carbs are fiber. So really only three net carbs per serving. I love edamame, so I thought, why not try that out? And then I also got, these are sea salt and cracked pepper gourmet roasted peanuts. These only have five carbs per serving and two grams of fiber. So again, three net carbs. I felt like those just sounded really yummy. I got this little bundle of scrunchies. They're all velvet. This was $5.99 and it's got all these colors in it. Oh, it's got six colors. So basically a dollar per scrunchie. Thought they were really cute. I also saw somebody post about um, I Love Sarai and her like little hack where you put scrunchies on your arms when you're washing your face so the water kind of like gets trapped there instead of running all over your arms. So I may try to do that. These little bobby pins are so cute. These are Betsy Johnson. This was $10, which is kind of pricey, but look at the little lips. They're so cute. These are great for Valentine's Day. I got two of these little containers. I thought these were really adorable and maybe the right size for lipsticks. So they were $5.99 and they're a really nice acrylic and they've got like a little crystal type of handle on the top. But I felt like two of these would be really handy. I got a Lime Crime Software Blush. This was only $5.99. I've never tried their blushes and I just thought this would be a fun thing to get. It's got really funky packaging. And this is in the shade Zip. And I felt like this looked like a really, oh, it's cream. Okay, I did not know this was cream. I'm so stupid. So stupid. Oh, okay, yeah, it's cream to powder. Cause I was like, wow, that's got a weird consistency, but it becomes really powdery. So I swatched it right here. It's a nice soft pink. Interesting. Also from TJ Maxx, I haven't gotten to the raw stuff yet. This little top I found on clearance for $6. And I thought this would be really cute for summer, especially for videos. It's just like this little, slinky bit of orange that I thought would be really, really cute. All right, I think everything else is from Ross. So this tray was $9.99 and it's marble looking. I just thought this would be really cute either on the coffee table or for like pictures to lay stuff in for pictures. I think that would be cute too. So I think it's really nice with a little gold trim. I like it a lot. I also was desperately looking for shoes for work and literally I looked everywhere else first and then I was like, you know, what the hell, maybe I'll find something at Ross. And I actually found some Pumas that I liked, not just for work, but just for like to have tennis shoes. This is the first pair. This was $39.99. They're a size eight and a half and they look like this. I love black tennis shoes. I typically get all black, like that's what I was looking for. All black Nikes, look at this slipping out of my fine little hair. But I usually get all black Nikes, that's my thing. And I just couldn't find any that I like that much, but these are pretty cute. I used to have Pumas back in the day that I absolutely love. Also got this, this is like an as seen on TV thing, but it's called Heel-tastic. I looked up some reviews while I was in the store and I was like, well, why not give it a try? All day at work, I'm on my feet, so my, my heels are just really horrendous looking. So I'm like, why not? I'll give it a shot. A couple t-shirts. This one's a little bit of a crop. It says, what is done in love is done well got Van Gogh paintings on there. 
I love Van Gogh, so I just thought that would be cute. Okay, this is a really fun shirt. This was only $11.99. The Van Gogh one was only $7.99. But this one was $11.99 and it says made in the 90s. It's like a distressed looking long sleeve tee and it's so good. We got Rocket Power, Angry Beavers, Hey Arnold, Rocco's Modern Life. It's got Nickelodeon down the arm and then it says made in the 90s down the other arm. I just thought that was so, so cute. We're almost done. This other pair of Pumas is typically like what I buy always. It's like all black tennis shoes. And I was really happy with this find. They were $37.99, all black with a little light pink Puma on there. But I love these for the gym. I'll also sometimes wear them to work. These have more of that like mesh all over. So they're nice and breathable. My feet get super, super hot. I don't know why. So hot. And then we have one last thing. I picked up this laundry basket because I have clothes everywhere. And I don't know when I'm going to be able to get my closet in order. So until then, I have some more storage. And then once everything's put away, I have somewhere to start piling stuff up before it's a mess again. All right. So that is everything that I've been buying at TJ Maxx for literally like the past two months, apparently. I can't believe I've waited this long to film. I have a pile of receipts right here. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Leave me a big thumbs up if you like seeing what I find. Like I love finding bargains and I like seeing what other people get too. So hopefully you guys like that as well. Well, and I can't wait to see you guys in my next video. Bye!